What up, yo? I go by the undeniable name of Dame will never been a lame O. It's your boy, that boy, Bari. And I'm Jay Willie, the podcast killer. Uh, guess what? This is Willie Wednesdays. Um, mm-hmm. We got some shit to talk about. Barry yes, got sir. something over there. Yes, Barry sir. got something. What you got and, for me, boy? And, and play what you playing so we can talk about it. All right, I'm going to play the voice note. Shout out to this listener. Shout out. You know what? I'm going to give her, her props. Shout out to um, um Raven because she's been asking for a shout out for, for supposedly giving us good content to talk about. I'm oh, so this, this is Raven doing all of this? This For this particular topic, yes. So I give her her props for that. Shout out to Raven. So. I'm about to play a clip clip real quick. Hold on. And another question. Why are men so comfortable with asking for sex immediately after learning a girl's name, but she can't ask for money? Why? 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 He's so comfortable with, all right, so when am I coming over? And it'd be fucking... One o'clock in the morning. When am I coming over? Can I come over? Can I come over? But as soon as she said, "Um, can you cash at me? I want to go get my nails done. It's a problem. Can you cash at me? I want to go do this. I want to go go do that. It's a problem. You're asking for sex, but I can't ask for money. You're weird. <laughs> weird. You're weird. weird. Bella, you're you're weird. You're weird. But yeah. <laughs> you can't just be broke. That'd <laughs> <laughs> be weird. No, nah, okay. So, what what was the what like what was the very? She said, "Why is it?" She I'm said, to get to the, "Why is it okay for a man to ask for sex after oh, barely okay. knowing your name?" I'm, I'm, I'm gonna answer why it's okay, and I don't think it's okay. But if I was <laughs> that guy, no, 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 I, we have to. If we're talking about it, we have to talk about it. If I was that guy who who did that kind of thing. Right. I would feel like it's okay because more times than not, it's working. Mm-hmm. So, hmm. if we are creatures of habit and we're creatures of learned behavior, if something is working or has worked, you'll be more inclined to do so because it's worked. Yeah. So, if you're a guy and you lead with asking and you get, why the hell would you change? I could agree. I agree. Yeah. Um, just, and, just to take it as at, at face value, right? Well, in right. in in that in that sense, I do agree, because yes, a lot of times as men, we have gotten. It's about to sound so crazy that I'm gonna say this, but we have gotten pussy for free. If it if if it if it this makes sense, this dick ain't free. Just by asking, <laughs> what you're trying to say. Right, no, legit. Like you, you put in a little bit of work. You text. You cute enough. You you. You talk, you, you you talk right. You talk proper. You say the right things. You could get a pull up to the crib, and the most you got to do is have a bottle on deck, got a little bit of food in the crib, or you you know buy something, whatever. Right. A and bottle of that purity vodka thirty four. Yeah, yeah. Come on now. And I because am. of that, you 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 have that on deck. More times than not, it has worked in our favor to get some pussy. Mm-hmm. So now. From a male's perspective, whenever that happens, now you want to come ask us for bread. It's like, yo, check this out, shorty. You're not on that kind of type of time. Like, what? Who are you to ask me for some bread for something that you gave me for free already? That's how niggas be sinking. Mm. But like I said to you earlier, I do get from the perspective of a woman that, like, yo, you asking for something that is supposedly valuable to me, and then now when I act, when I say, hey, can you just at least doubt on me a little bit? Is an issue, so I do get that perspective of it from the from the female perspective as well. It's go go ahead, Dame. I'm sorry. I'm absolutely tired of us putting value on on on, on pussy. You mean like, price I'm, on pussy, not value. Price, price. My bad. I did say the wrong word. Not value. Price, price. I'm tired of price. I I'm agree. Tired of price. I think it's ridiculous, man. Like, I mean, in that case, I'm not going to ask you nothing. I'm gonna just throw you a hundred dollar bill, and it's like we ain't got to have words. <laughs> No, you know what, I'm what, what, what am I asking for? What am I pursuing? What you just you told me a price. Here we go. Mm-hmm. All right, here. That to me is like duh. I don't I don't like that argument because I think women are on the losing side of that argument. 
So a, a, a very a very wise young lady uh, once said that um, we need to look at it at the same way that it's being said, right? Okay. So men are leading with, hey, sex, what's up? Pull up, pull right. up, pull up, pull up, pull up, right? The women aren't saying, okay, yeah, you want me to pull up? Send me 100. They're saying, if you have the audacity to ask me off rip to pull up so you right. can get some sex, I should. I, um, I should be able to, on the flip side, off rip, be like, yo, I'm trying to get my nails and my feet done. What's up? And that, without, and, any, without, any, without anything being exchanged. And, and, and in that regard, I get it. Because it's like, bro, you asking for something that's, for example, men, we covered our bread. That's a fact. We covered our penis and our bread. So now, you, wanna, you want me to give you something that I, cov- I covet so much? Cool. Now I'm going to ask you for something that you covered a lot. You covered your bread, so what's up? Give me a piece of that. Because you're clearly asking for something that I want, that I hold dear, near and dear to my heart. So why can't yeah, I, I mean, ask for the same thing? The only, the only, the only, I guess, disagreement I have with that, yeah. right. not every guy just values their penis and their bread. No, true. True. I'm More times than not, like, I'll say that. But that's why it always comes back to this value versus price conversation. Like, what's valuable to you? Right. Because a guy that got money, he just wastes it. It's not valuable. He got it. That's it. Like we so said a couple weeks ago. That's a fact. It's, it's that's absolutely. Like, that's why I don't like. I don't like this argument. I don't like it. I don't like. It. I just really don't. Like I really, really don't. But even if you just, if you just a dude that got. So basically, all she's saying is, if you got a whole lot of money, then it's cool. You can have all the pussy you want. <laughs> yeah, I don't like that. That's how I see it. To be I honest, like that. I see it. Yeah, I, I just don't. I, I don't like that argument. I think you know. I'm sorry. Women on the losing end of that argument. So, but then even- okay, so Dame, Dame, what if a young lady you walk up to a young lady like, yo, what's up? Find you very attractive. How you right. doing? Whatever the case may be, <laughs> she just, I bet, yo, I'm trying to get my. Hand. What's up? I'm sorry. Go ahead. I'm sorry. I cut you off. What do you say? I I need my my nail my my nail. I need my nails and my hair. And she done. needs some nail. And she needs some my, nail. My, my car, <laughs> my car breaks. My car breaks is a little fucked up. So if you can get me some brake pads, that's dope. Um. And you know, I, I I need to pay the babysitter. So what's up? I mean, it ain't tricking if you got it, right? Like if you got it, you got it. If you don't got it though, you know, and that's what I'm saying. That's I, I you're not gonna give me the pleasure of this. I don't like the argument, man. I'm sorry. I, I get it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah. I feel I, like the part of it's about to sound, I may get even trouble for this. I feel like a lot of times women on girlfriend treatment, i.e. i.e. in terms of money, mm-hmm. when they're not girlfriends, right? We have sex. Cool. It's not like before where if you had sex, you y'all went together, y'all go together. No, we're in a time now where people are sexually li- sexually liberated. So cool. You want to have sex with me? I want to have sex with you. Ain't nothing. That's true. But that's and, been happening for eons, my nigga. Right. But now you can't. You can't. You can't act with something that. Is girlfriend material because I, me personally, I would, I have never paid for a girl's nails that's not a girl that I seriously fuck with or that's not my girl. But who's okay? But uh, who's to say what's boyfriend and girlfriend material? Because you're saying, oh, you about to ask me for bread? You must be my girl. She could be like, oh, you about to ask me for sex? You must be my nigga. Right. But but this is but here's the th- but here's the I thing now. I, I don't see the equality there. But but but, but this is where I'm saying there's. It, this is the problem. Women want it to be equal in the sense of sex because they want to be able to f- have sex and fuck whomever they want to, whenever they want to, which you have all rights to do. And they, and they, and they do it. Cool, and I'm not mad at it. But now you can't say you want to be sexually liberated like men, but then on the flip side, then now want to come ask me for something that's only coveted for a specific tier of women. Ah, but see, once again, what, what, uh, you lost me. You, because that's unfair. Because yeah. so it's so it's so, it's, so it's her pussy, technically. Right. But then you don't have to. But you don't have to give it to me. You can't. Want, my thing is, you can't want to move. You can't want to move on these streets like a nigga and want to. Cool, I like this nigga. I want to fuck him. Then fuck him. And then now want to come talk about. I right, cool. I want my nails done. My hair done. My brakes is that, fucked okay, up. So, 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 so that, that, what I'm trying to say is, let's take it from the fact of sex didn't happen. Mm-hmm. At all, right? Okay. We lead with sex. 
mm-hmm. she leads with I need this, this, this done. Right. Nothing happened. Right. Gotcha. It was just the lead. Mm-hmm. Right. I think the voice note is is is, is talking about that, right? right. Like, I feel like I'm on both sides, and every time somebody says something, I sway a little bit. So I'm like, ah, because you it make because it makes sense. You get where it's coming from, but at the same time, as a nigga, you like, nah, like I get it because I understand because it too. What, what you're saying is, oh, I I got the sex for free, and now you ask me for something. What I'm saying is, the sex didn't happen. Mm-hmm. You ask this young lady, yo, what's up? Pull up to my crib. I mean, Saturday. After the right. club, I mean, I, I should be home like 2, 2.30. What's up? I could send an Uber. I could pick you up, whatever the case may be. Right. That's just the ask, right? Right. He, in turn, is like, oh, I mean, I, I, I guess that sounds cool, but my, my, my hair and nails look crazy. So before I come see you, like, yo, swing that so I can look presentable for you. You as a, you as a guy, you're going to be like, fuck out of here. I look like paying for your hair and nails. She's going to be like, fuck out of here. What you look like calling me over at two o'clock in the morning for some pussy like but even in that regard true say like dame said before and you said off mic that's completely transactional now cool i'm paying for you to look presentable for me and me only come to me after I, you, as soon as your nail and hair is done pull up i'm splacking your shit and that's that you know what I'm saying, and and it could be like that because clearly you can't. You said that off of the pretense of me saying, "Hey, pull up at two two thirty. Yeah. All right. Okay. I see you what you're saying. saying. I'm, I'm no, but I'm I'm swaying more towards what Jay is talking about because if it is, well, what y'all, if it is transactional and that's the agreement, I don't think there's nothing wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? It's I like, well, it. I want this, you want that. We high five, <laughs> shake and agree, niggas. <laughs> there we mm. go. All right, cool. That makes sense. But when you put it in a perspective of I've already gotten it already, or you know, or something like that, then it kind of that that changes it. That definitely changes. That that sways the narrative. So, but this is what I'm saying. I've been I've been taking you down for a while long already, and now all of a sudden now you're asking me for bread. I mean, yeah, that's a little weird. It's a little weird. If that wasn't our relationship. At the same, you see, that's what I'm trying to say. Like, I'm just swaying. I feel like I'm on both sides of the fence. Yo, because at the same time, time, you have been. What's wrong with you? Bless her with some bread. Why she right. can't say, yo, not for nothing, yo. We 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 already crossed that level. Right. Like, I, some I, I agree right. with you. Like, yes, most, I agree. Most niggas would be like, fuck out of here. I ain't saying you like what? What? Now sure you want my bread? Like, blah, 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 blah. no, that's like, a now fact. We get, yeah. Now, now we're getting to that bag. Now she a gold digger. Now no, you but, I, but, ass this, ass. but this I was is like, why your boyfriend for some bread? But Nobody I'm heard. in agreement with you, bro, because after a certain point, it's like, bro, you've been fucking this girl for about two, three months now. You mean to tell me you legit. Can't bless Shorty with a, a little something if she asks for it. That's what you're telling me. You're wilding, bro. But no, niggas, I, I, I agree. You know what I'm saying? I agree. And it's like, listen, if, if you're having sexual intercourse with somebody, they have all rights to be like, yo, I'm kind of fucked up right now. Yo, my tire just popped on the highway, bro. Right? And you swing yo. me eighty so I can get the t- I'm used. Bro, tire. I saw a post. I saw a post that a girl said. I saw a post that is from Twitter where a girl said, yo. Ladies, if you fucking this nigga and you can't ask this nigga at any point in time to help you out with a little something, yo, pay your little hundred dollar phone you bill, or whatever, or 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 your I tire mean, or whatever, and this nigga look at you nigga. like you crazy, you fucking the wrong nigga. Even if you just oh, fucking the nigga, I, and I agree. But you are what you negotiate, and that's oh, a good that's life. a good point. That's a good point, Dave. You are what you negotiate. You are what so, you, you get what you is, negotiate. Is, 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 that a, is, that a, is that a Dane philosophy that's why, that's, thing? But that's, the reason, <laughs> but that's the reason why, like, I don't, that's why I don't like this argument because it's, it, it turns into woman bashing almost. It's like, I get it, but it's mm-hmm. like, you know, it, it is a value versus, versus price. So, you know, it's a, it's a, I don't like that. It's like, well, then you got to tell women to negotiate better before they fuck. It's like, well, kind of. <laughs> like, but you know, it's like that. You know, it seemed like it's men jumping on women, so I don't really like. You know, it's like you're trying to negotiate for this. But I, yo, hey, and <laughs> men jumping on women. But I'm not. I don't want to drag this conversation, right? But I do. I have some homegirls. Legitimately, they don't just let any and every nigga fuck. Why? Because they know for a fact that the nigga that they fuck at any point in time, they do pick up the phone and call this nigga. Not saying that they're gonna act for Chanel bags or whatever the case may be, but. If they do call this nigga, cool. Hey, yo, bro, I'm down and out real quick. I need a calm. I need. I need you to help me out real quick. Cool, I got you. It ain't nothing. Yeah, if you got it, you got it. And that's why. But I this. Is, but I, that's I, why I'm I, saying it's a cyclical argument. <laughs> you gonna keep going in circles. 
So yeah, but it's a cyclical argument, yo. I see both sides. As a man, of course, I see my I see our side a little more, of course, because that's just me being biased as a man. But I do get where they coming from. I do get where sis is coming from in that argument. I'm not even gonna sit here. I just don't get that it's weird. I don't like that. I don't like that terminology. But but what after, after, after we talked it out and after we had the conversation that we had earlier prior to the show, I'm more so on the on the lady side now. Right? Really? I am because if you could fix your lips to say, "Yo, what's up? Let me get some pussy." I can fix my lips and be like, all right, yo, what's up? Let me get blah, blah, blah. That's what I was and saying to you earlier. But that, that's what I'm saying. I'm, that's why I'm I put that talking it out, talking it through. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now I understand because now, now we're talking about nothing happened at all. No sex has been given, right? Sex did uh, not happen. Facts. You ask for this, they ask for that. You cannot, you cannot turn around and be like, yo, show to your gold digger. She's wild and she's crazy. No, bro, you just asked for some pussy. Like... <laughs> You just solicited some pussy. So she could definitely black on you, right? Now, and what if her shit is fire? Like, what if she know her shit fire? You said what? I said, what if you, and what if she know her shit fire? She got the Gog Gog 3000. Shit is the wet wet. I don't don't know that. So that means nothing. But but I'm saying she knows that. So because she know that, she's not just willing to give that up until she know that it's in her favor. Understood, but I don't know that. So I don't give a fuck about that. Yeah. Because we don't know. And, and we don't know. And it might, what may be good for one person may not be good for another person. Like, exactly. Your yeah. shit can be the best for Jonathan. Right. I'm not Jonathan. Yo, you be <laughs> like, picking some of the randomest names on God. Like, I, <laughs> Jonathan. I, I freestyle a name. It just comes this nigga, this nigga, Jonathan, like everything. I'm, <laughs> I'm just like, you could be amazing for Jonathan, but you're boo boo for me. Right. And you think that you're God's gift to Earth. No, your shit is trash. It could be like that. True. Hey. But if you can fix her lips and still ask for some, I guess she can fix her lips and ask for some money. I get it. I, I, if we if we're gonna be fair, I think we need to give women that and be fair with it because that we grace, do that out, credence. No, because because as as guys, we be like fuck out of yo yo. Show you a gold dick, yo. She trying to get in my pockets. Blah, 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 blah. No, but at the same time, we we asking for some for some box. It's like right, like what you asking for pussy? It's not like you just ask if to, oh go on a date or just, no, you asking for pussy. Pussy. Unless, unless you're really trying to invite them over to the crib to get to know them better. Hey, hey, hey. And no to be involved. Unless you're a you're real, that. you're a real great guy. I mean, yeah, <laughs> you're a real Amen. great guy. Listen, <laughs> you're a swell gentleman. All you think about is her well-being, and you're saving yourself for that one true woman. I mean, it, listen, it, I. I don't think all men are created equal. I think everybody. <laughs> I, 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 that's so funny, bro. I don't. I don't think all men are created equal. I don't think that all men have the same. What was the laugh? Yeah, yeah like, he said, I don't think all men were created equal. That's funny, bro. bro I, I, I don't. don't. I think you get the, the highly toxic niggas that's like, yo, th- I've been doing this for so long. It works for me. I'm going to continue it. And then you get the guys that's like, yo, I'm looking for a companion. I'm looking for this. I'm looking for that. So I'm willing to wait. I'm not going to rush it. So I can't just put everybody in one box like this is what it is. I can't do that. Long story short, ladies, don't go to nobody's house at 2 o'clock in the morning. Unless you're willing Um, to fuck them for real. No, unless you're willing to pay. (laughs) I was going to say, unless you wanted to have sex with him. Did you hear his rape culture come out of his mouth? That was rape culture? Yeah. No, wait, no, what Barry said. Oh, How oh, would oh. I say? I said, unless you want to fuck him, not the nigga. I said, ladies, unless you give consent and you want to have sex with the nigga. Nah, you ain't saying no, I ain't say all that. that. I said, unless you want, I said, unless you want to fuck him. What did I say? That's rapey. Nah, yo, wait. What I said was rapey? Wait, wait, wait. Late. Wait, wait. We going to see. Wait. Wait. What did I say something rapey just now? He said, I'll hey, come over three in the morning. Let's go. Oh, come on, Wade. Listen, Wade want to stay out of it. See, look what you did. You, like, you, got Wade, you got Wade in your pocket. That's why. You got him on payroll. It's all good. I know what the fuck's going on, my nigga. It's Listen, all good. Yo, all right, man. At the end of the day, long story short, we about to get up out of here, but I do want to say, Barry, stop being rapey. I love you. Good night. <laughs> man, I just want to thank you so much for tuning into Willow Wednesdays. We love and appreciate facts, the facts, support. Facts, facts. Yeah, yeah. If you ain't done so already, please hit the like and subscribe button for the YouTube page. Big facts. Yes, yes, yes. And click the bell for notifications. Mm-hmm. And make sure to join that family page, the Will and Wednesday family page on Facebook. Mm-hmm. Peace.